We are learning more about the three Houston children killed by their adoptive mother in California last month. That entire family dead after investigators say she drove off a cliff and may have been drunk at the time. New tonight, we're hearing from a man who says he helped to raise those children. Sion Rhodes joining us live downtown with more on this sad story. Sion? And those children grew up, Bill, on Houston's south side. Those who know them believe they would still be alive today if they'd been allowed to stay with their own family. Jesus loves them. At a vigil yeah. Monday morning, strangers gathered to honor the lives of three children gone too soon. Yeah. But in the small crowd, one man who did know them. I'm a lonely daddy. Nathaniel Davis was the children's stepfather. They were three kids. The mother was very smart. According to court documents, the children's biological mother lost custody of the children in 2006 because of drug abuse and prior history with CPS. But Davis says she was a good mother. Everybody got problems. She was sweet. She never did let them kids do that. She would do that before them kids. Though he wanted to keep them, Davis says he wasn't allowed because of health concerns and the fact that he wasn't their biological father. They went to live with an aunt who tried to adopt them, but her bid rejected after the mother had an unapproved, unsupervised visit with them. The way they took them kids, that was wrong. After nearly a decade of not knowing where they were or how they were, Davis and other relatives learned last week the children were dead. It's hurting me because I know that we had more to offer them. Then the, the, the people did. I, I just miss some kids so much. Little ones to him belong. They are weak, but we are strong. And the family is hoping that the children can be brought back to Texas for burial. Reporting live downtown, Sion Rhodes, KPRC Channel 2 News.